What's up guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be giving you a movie review of Maleficent. So I went to go see this today and man do I tell you this movie was freaky, gorgeous, the scenery, the music was beautiful. Oh my lord. Mm. Maleficent was well. Angelina Jolie was freaking gorgeous. Oh man. I don't want to I don't want to spoil it because it's not a spoiler review, it's a movie review. So, I'm just going to give you my thoughts of the movie. So, my thoughts of this movie, going into it, was like, it was really different from the first one. If you've seen the first one, and you've seen this one, the second one, you know it's, you can tell that it's different from the first one. Because, it was just, Freaking, uh, it was just gorgeous, amazing. The music was my favorite in this movie. Maleficent herself, her, I just thought, looking at her wings was just so satisfying to me to look at. Because, you know, like, when she, like, spreads them out, it was, like, so freaking cool to me. To like I said, if you haven't heard, and my, well, I'm going to be uploading a video on my Patreon that's going to be up very, very soon. It's a Thor Ragnarok. And in that video, I say CGI. I think I say it in that video. But I say CGI is my favorite thing to look at because it's satisfying, satisfying to me to look at for some reason. Because when you see them, like, like if they're jumping off a building or something, or, or you see Hulk and you see him, with his CGI, it's, it's satisfying to me to look at, like, the big wolf and stuff, or, like, her, the way she, like, is her wings, they just, she just glides so beautifully, she just, it's just amazing, I don't really know how to explain this, this movie, like, it was just, it was so good, like, I don't even know how Michelle Pfeiffer was in it. You had Angelina Jolie, Michelle Pfeiffer. Like, I was like, oh, Michelle Pfeiffer, she freaking did an amazing job. Like, oh my lord, like, this movie was just, it was good. Like, like, I haven't seen the Disney movie in the, I don't know, how many years. Like, it's been so while you know, since I've seen the normal Disney movie. Like, so when I saw this, this would legit brought me back to my childhood. Like, because I watched the award Sleeping Beauty. I watched the Sleeping Beauty cartoon movie, which was very good to me. And watching the... I don't remember what happened in the first one, but it, it, this one was very different from the first one. Like, oh, the scenery, like, and then the little creatures and stuff, they're, it's so, the, every little detail in this movie is, is freak, freaking amazing. And I'm, it's like, wow. Like, I don't know what to say. It was just, it was just so, it was actually pretty good. Like, I was going into this movie to, to think that it like, like it was just going to be like one of those Disney movies that they do like over and over sometimes. Like, you get used to the, to what they do in the Disney. But in this one, they didn't do that. That was like, it was something different about the movie. But I don't, I was about to say something from the movie, but I'm not, I'm not going to do that. But, this movie, if you, if you like Maleficent, and like, she's like your, your top favorite villain, your top favorite Disney villain, I recommend you to go see this movie. Because, man, 
Angelina Jolie, Michelle Pfeiffer. Amazing job. Amazing job. And you know, Angelina Jolie is about to be in a Marvel film. She's, in, she's in one of the Eternals. I think she's playing Athena, I think her name is. I don't, I don't really know any of the Eternals. I have to, I have to read about them. But you know, her, their, their Marvel movie is coming out in next November, next year, next year. So, I'm excited to see her in that. Like, it was so good. Like, I don't want to spoil nothing. It was just so good. Like, like, like I said, I was going into the movie, like, expecting not to like it. But as I'm watching the movie, it, like, drawn me into the movie. Like, I was just sitting there just staring. Like, like just mesmerized by every single scene, every scene, every every detail and every scenery, thinking how her costumes changed throughout the movie. Like that that was just crazy to see. And then uh, I don't wanna say nothing. I don't, I want to say so what happened in the movie, so bad, like, I'm telling you, like, if y'all want to go see it, I'm going to laugh at some movie, and she's like, you're, you're top, 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 you it's just, I'm not going to explain what that side is, but if you've seen the movie, then you know what I'm talking about. But you, you see a side of her that you never expected from her to see. It, it's like, you think, you think you, she's going to, I'm hard to my sport of this. Because I really want to just, I, the spoiler review is going to come probably tomorrow. Or Thursday, probably. I don't know when, but it's gonna come. It's gonna come. But man, yeah, this movie was. It was good. It was freaking good. Like, I mean, I know some some people might say that it wasn't the the best the best movie, but I think I think it was good. Knowing me, if you don't know me, I love Disney. So anything Disney related, I like. So I have to go see it because one is Maleficent, two is Disney. But I haven't seen a good old fashioned Disney movie like this in I don't know how many years. Like it was just so good to sit and watch a Disney movie. And just chill from all the from, from all the action, like, you know. Because you know we had endings and we had Joker and stuff, and we had we had all this the Spider-Man controversy and stuff, and it was just nice to just sit and chill and just watch a Disney movie. Like it was just it was calming, it was it was relaxing. The music was amazing. I'm gonna keep saying that because it was, and I love the music. Matter of fact, after this, after this video, I'm going to listen to the soundtrack because it was just, it was, it was amazing. So like, it was just, it was, it was just beautiful. It was, it was a lot of color to it. It was a lot. Of, even the castle in the movie. Amazing. Like, mm -hmm. but this movie, I was I was like for real not expecting to like it, but then as I kept watching it, it draws your attention to the movie. Like I said, it's like really different. It's completely different from the first movie. I and mean, this is a sequel to that movie, but this sequel is 
completely different from that movie. Um, it was just amazing to watch and see how much Maleficent has evolved in that movie. Because, like I said, there's a side of her that you've never seen from her before. So, you'll, you'll hear what that side is when I talk about it in the story review, whenever I drop that in the review. But, yeah, a story review might be coming tomorrow or Thursday, like I said. But yeah, this movie was, was amazing. I, it was just good to just, like sit back and just chill and watch a Disney movie. Like it brought back childhood memories for my for myself because I would just sit home and like just chill and just watch Disney, you know? Because that was a thing for me to do. Like now, like I'm 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 an adult now, so I mostly watch a boat type a boat type movie now. But watching the Disney movie again was just, it was, I was glad I got to see this movie because I just got to chill, I just got to relax, there was no hypeness going on, because you know when I get high my blood pressure starts to rise up, so I was like, I'm glad I got to see some chill, and you know, Rise of Skywalker coming out in December, so I'm about to be real hyped, and you know, like I said, when I start to get hyped, I get hyped. Like the scene, the the scene in Endgame, where the where the, the big three Iron Man, Thor, and Tony, Iron Man, I said Thor, and Tony, Iron Man, Thor, and Cap, where they going to be Thanos, and they just murking them. I get really hyped. Like I start screaming. My voice starts to get strained. I start jumping out my seat like I'm a little crazy dude. But like, I was just, I was, I just, I'm just glad I got to watch a Disney movie. And just chill and relax. And I'm, I'm excited for the other, the other Disney stuff that's coming out. Like, I'm excited for the onward, the Onward, the new Pixar movie with Chris Pratt and Tom Hardy. I'm excited for Frozen 2 because I might take my nieces to go see it. And, oh yeah, and then Lives Out, that's coming out next month, November. Also, Disney Plus is coming out, so I expect some Mandalorian episodes on my channel, so that's going to be coming real soon, so. <coughs> And also, I'm going to explain, explain this again. I'm about to um, record some, record the first and second episode of The Flash. The third one, the third episode comes out tonight, but I'm not going to watch it. I'm going to wait till tomorrow so I can record episode three. So, I think tomorrow, tomorrow if I can edit and cut up the, cut up the episode of me reacting to it, I'll probably put it up tomorrow or Thursday, if not Thursday, Friday, or this weekend. Because it takes a while to edit and cut up those videos. So, also, like I said, if you want to follow my Patreon, I'm about to put up a full, full movie reaction. I'm being reacting to Thor Rackham. So, yeah, that will be on my Patreon. And I hope you guys enjoyed this movie review. I really enjoyed this movie. If you guys seen the seen the video and you're watching this movie review, tell me how you what you thought of the movie and what 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 parts of the movie did you like? And did, was it just was it just just fun to just sit there and just chill and watch a good old Disney movie? Like just just let me know down in the comments because. I freaking love this movie. But anyway, I'll see you guys in the next video. Make sure you guys subscribe, like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. College boy. Deuces.